let's begin with the basic skills. First is gripping. For the forehand grip, put your right hand on the face of the racket and slide it down until you hit the grip. Close the three fingers and put your thumb finger above the middle finger. In that case, it will also help you switch to backhand grip easily. Have your thumb finger further away from the three fingers, press your thumb on the widest surface, and relax your index finger closer to the middle finger. The thumb is used to generate and control power. The backhand grip is like you're doing a thumbs up. Second is the ready position. You should always have to be ready with the help of the ready stand with somewhat like wide stance. Your feet a little more with shoulder width apart. Your weight should be lowered with your knees slightly bent so that you can easily move when necessary. Keep your eyes straight on the shuttlecock and hold tightly on the racket. Third is serving. We have two types of serving, the long and short serving. To do the long serve, you need to hit the shuttlecock using underhand forehand stroke. Meanwhile, for the short serve, you need to hit the shuttlecock underhand backhand stroke. Always remember that you cannot and should not serve until the receiver is ready. Fourth is the stroke. When the shuttlecock flies going towards a particular area around your body, you need to use different strokes such as underarm forehand stroke, underarm backhand stroke, overhead forehand stroke, and overhead backhand stroke. Lastly is the footwork. The most important and effective footwork is the asteris form, in which you go sideways or diagonal ways. Always have your starting point at the center. After hitting the shuttlecock, always go back to your base, the center point.